Now, your forecast from Fox 56 News, the weather authority. All right, good morning, everybody. Actually, some showers to track for us this morning. Much needed showers at that. Thanks to a cold front that's working its way across the state as we're kicking off the day. So let's give you a quick little zoom in and a quick tour across the region as to where we've got these showers. We're close up on uh, southern parts of Jessamine County, looking into northern Garrett County, back over into uh, Boyle County. A couple of little batches of showers here, uh, really right along the Kentucky River. Back down to the southwest between Harrisburg and Danville. Another batch coming out of Marion County. We'll be heading over toward Perryville soon. That'll be second round of showers over in Perryville. Another one here just off to the northeast of Richmond. That'll keep moving further away from Richmond as these are going northeast. A little isolated couple of sprinkles really back over into the western part of Scott County. Eastern Kentucky, maybe a sprinkle near Campton and Wolf County. That's it. Uh, no real rain down here far to the south yet. A little shower trying to develop here into Casey County, just southeast of Liberty. But the clouds are increasing. We can see that here from our home view in Paris. It's dry though. Take an umbrella with you because some scattered showers will remain in the forecast through the day as this front just keeps working east. And we're going to kind of dig in a trough. So that trough in the base of that, we're going to get some rising air, especially on the eastern fringe of that. And that's what's creating these showers actually behind the front is this trough digging right here. But there's just not a lot to this, okay? We'll take what we can get, that's for sure. We've got stuffy air out there today with this front coming in. But finally, by tomorrow, the humidity even lower. We see that nosedive, and we also see in some lower humidity that lasts through the rest of the week. Let's look here at Futurecast. There are those scattered showers hanging on, kind of off and on, afternoon, even into the evening, some isolated showers, but the chance really goes down tonight into tomorrow. And tomorrow should feature uh, more sunshine as we go into the afternoon. Let's go ahead and get to your seven day forecast. We are tracking that less humid air that's moving in as we go into Wednesday. Thursday, this is going to be some cool mornings. This should say pleasant for the afternoon uh, with highs in the middle 70s. Going into the upcoming weekend, there's another disturbance that likely drops in into Sunday that may bring another chance for some showers. Look at these overnight lows. 50 Thursday morning, 40s by Friday morning. Sports is up after the break.